What's going on guys, I'm Ari H3, today I'm bringing you a new video. Today's video is a playoff home leg against Rotherham United. Hoping for uh, a good score on the ball today, uh, I'd like a 3-1. My score prediction for today's game is going to be... Yeah, I'll say 3-1 score I don't really think it's going to happen, but um, it would be a really good result if we managed to get this. It's an early kick-off today, 12.30, it's going to be a good atmosphere. And hopefully Scunny can just give it the raw and play like they've been playing these last couple of games of the season. Ignore Bradford's performance because we didn't really put our starting line up at, as it is. But yeah, we need strong performance from all the boys today. And uh, yeah, we do, we've do we lost to Rotherham twice this season so it's not going to be an easy game. And uh, she's been winning Charlton 1-0 away from uh, their ground as well. It's going to be a difficult game. But yeah, if we can hit 30 likes because it's a big game today, a big playoff game. And it's uh, going to be a good atmosphere. Um, I do hope you guys enjoy this video and if you do make sure to give my channel a subscribe I'm also going to the away game against Rotherham on Wednesday night That's going to be another great game and if we manage to come out victorious on both of them occasions We can have a trip to Wembley which will be mad Good day out, it's been, I think last time I was at Wembley was 2009 So uh, yeah, I'm just about to set off to the ground now <laughs> Now uh, for the game, I'm feeling quite confident on uh, today's performance. We just need to put a solid performance in from the boys. We go for the same lineup we have near the end of the season. Um, I just feel like we're going to win today. It might be scrappy at times, but I do feel like we're going to get the win, get it done today. And because uh, Rotherham always going to be a very difficult game, we probably, we've lost twice to these this season. They are a good team, and uh, yeah, it's currently about half eleven, so we're now from kick off. Apparently, um, quite going to be quite full today. Um, hopefully, we can just push for promotion and get into the championship and get some big teams away next season, which will be good. Um, if you haven't subscribed already, make sure to give me a subscribe, and uh, I'll see you when we're outside um, near kickoff. Come out now and uh, yeah, line up. I'm happy with. Uh, got Dwayne Funzo playing, which is good. Good strong lineup. Um, Rotherham have brought a lot. I think they've completely sold out there. Yeah, it's gonna be a good atmosphere. And hopefully we can get the behind the boys today and just give it a raw roll. Nick, we swap lost for Nick Dawes. Um, we didn't lose with him last season. We didn't lose with him this season. Uh, well, not last season. When uh, Robbins got sacked, we had him. But, yeah, I'm just feeling really confident about today. I do feel like we'll get the job done. Rotherham away on Wednesday, but hopefully we can just get a good result. I'll take a draw. I'd take anything except a loss, because if, we'll, if we lose this game... Uh, it's going to be really difficult to win Rotherham away from home, especially when we've lost to these twice this season. But yeah, we're still half an hour from kickoff, and Rotherham are filling up their end, which is going to be good, and it's going to be filling up our end. So it's going to be a great game, and uh, I'll see you just before kickoff. Very end to end, uh, got a corner now. Uh, it got passed out wide to Clark, and Clark ran onto it, but uh, took a heavy touch. But yeah, it's going to pop. We've got a corner. Great atmosphere, loud from both sides. Um, yeah, we've got the corner now. Come on, Morris, let's have a good look at Another corner. Morris, Tom's on his own, he had a shot, came up in that rubber and defenders. Good start from the iron. Keeps on this one. That was a poor corner from a keeper. It hit uh, a rubber. It just didn't go high enough. Yeah. Poor corner from a keeper. Another corner. Penalty shout as well. Ivan Tony went down. I don't know if he uh, tripped or it looked like they defended the corner. But, uh, no one really called for a penalty there. But we got another corner there. Three corners already in the game. We're only. Six minutes in. Oh, again and again. Jolly Clark's giveaway found it looked like push up back, but yeah, six minutes in and then it's done. Um, 
We're like 15 minutes in and we're 1 0 down. Uh, got through Wallace and Mercado and just started out for 1 0. Um, yeah, very disappointed to be honest. It was a sloppy goal to concede. But they look the better team at the minute. Hopefully we can just get back straight back into this game. And uh, but yeah, Robin was always going to be in our team too. Really, what a game this is so far. We're 25 minutes in, it's 1 1, and uh, should, maybe it should be 2 1 there. But, yeah, come on, it's got 30 minutes from our time, and it's still 1 1. We've got a corner now. We can just put it in. It's a very nerve wracking game, I'm not going to lie. Especially when two teams, two good teams that have had a very good season, are at it. Atmosphere is mad as well. But both teams are just by far even better than Plymouth this game, which is completely mental, the atmosphere and everything. It's the key whips from winning. Every time, every time we whip the corner and the ref blows to offside or a push or something. Rather than keep power on the little card to come out, but yeah, very, very good game so far. 30 minutes from time. 5 minutes from time now and it is still 1-1. Uh, um, very end to one game at the minute. Um, one yellow for each team. I think Rotherham should have had a few more yellows, but refs decided not to. Um, could see any team grabbing this game. It's just... Atmosphere, just make it all different. Nerves from the players, just could go into when we could come out of this game 3 1 down or we could come out of it 3 1 up. It's just that sort of game at the minute. Both teams won it. Defence is quality from Scunny, defence is alright, quality from Rotherham as well. It's just a good game and a good atmosphere and just hopeful we can get something from this game. And I'm buzzing to go Rotherham away on Wednesday, which is going to be another good game. But yeah, we're five, five minutes from time and it's still 0 0. And if there's a goal, I'll let you guys know. Please. Oh, yeah. 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 Oh, yeah.
have only had two shots on target all game as well. Um, so, so it's a bit undeserved, but you've got to take it, haven't you? Still 10 minutes left, it's like, and we're going to have about six minutes of stoppage time as well. So. Three minutes left in there, we've got a free kick, edge of box. Oh, come on, Spray. If we lose this game, then we've just got to put bodies forward against Robin away. There's nothing, we've just got to. These are always the team to beat Rotherham. Probably the best team in the playoffs at the minute. I would say it would be all to hold Rotherham to go up to Championship. Show it in a lot of the goal. Come on, Morris. Uh, his left foot. So that was always going to happen. Come to nothing, really. I'll throw it.